Well, an unusual visitor was spotted at Rosar Park in Perry several days ago. City officials are now asking people to be cautious when visiting the park. Here's 41 NBC's Ariel Schiller. Rosier Park is no stranger to wildlife. Several days ago, a fisherman spotted an alligator in the pond. City officials want to make sure that you stay safe until it can be relocated. According to the Georgia Department of Natural Resources, alligators live along and south of the fall line. That means cities like Columbus, Augusta, and Macon are likely to have alligator sightings from time to time. You'll generally see them in a variety of wetland habitats, like swamps, rivers, and ponds. We spoke with wildlife biologist Bobby Bond. He says they get calls about gators in Rosier Park at least once a year. This is not the first time, and it won't be the last time. I mean, it's in, you know, it's within the gator range, and we've had other gators in the same exact pond. Cedric Swan is the director of leisure services for Perry. He says when they were made aware of the alligator, they called Animal Control, who then contacted the Department of Natural Resources. He says a trapper is coming to relocate the alligator. They have posted signs around the park warning people of alligators in the pond. He says if you're visiting the park, please be cautious. We want you to be aware of where you're stepping um, and when you're close to the water. Uh, just and be mindful of your children and your pets if you're walking around the pond. Swan says if you see an alligator at the park, leave it alone. Just allow them to, to bask in the sun and uh, enjoy yourself here at the park. Bond says it can even be a teachable moment for your children. Gators smaller than three feet are going for smaller prey like frogs and fish. Alligators six feet or larger go for larger prey. Bond says he should never feed an alligator. That's basically you give the animal a death sentence because it's now, instead of it normally being fearful of humans, it's then coming to humans for food. Cedric Swan says they're hoping to say see you later to the alligator by the end of the week. He says they'll post on social media when that happens. Reporting in Perry, Ariel Schiller, 41 NBC News. And Swan says they plan to have permanent signs installed warning people of the presence of gators in the pond. If you spot a gator, Notify the city immediately, and if you find yourself in a dangerous situation with a gator, you should call 911.